Hey, everyone. Welcome back to another new holiday episode of Lifestyle Today. I'm Justine Santanello. Hanukkah just started, and we're another week closer to Christmas and Kwanzaa. No matter what you guys celebrate, we've got a packed episode for you filled with ideas for gifts, entertaining, and really everything in between. Now, I don't know about you, but it's something about the holidays that makes me want to do more than usual to help those in need. Wasil Dowd is a content creator from New Jersey that has made it his mission to help the homeless almost every day. Wasil started channeling his creativity into funny food videos that brought tons of joy and laughter to others, but the result was a lot of food waste, and he became motivated to take action and adjust his strategy. Now, Wasil creates nutritious meals that he packages and delivers to the homeless all around his home state. Now, I recently had the pleasure to go out with Wasil to watch him deliver these meals, and I am very excited to have him here on the show today. Welcome. Hi, how are you? We're here. <laughs> we are here. A little different from when we were out in the street the other day, huh? Very different than well, we were out thank the you very, very much for being here. Absolutely. I'm super pumped to be here. So I have so many questions. I want to start from the beginning and how all of this began, you know, your journey to get where yeah. you are now. How did you go from these like more funny videos to now videos where you are making food and delivering it to people who need it? Yeah, no, absolutely. So, I mean, in the start, you know, I just wanted to make content to make yeah. people laugh. Uh, so I was getting a bunch of expired food and just dumping it all over the place. <sighs> Um, and it obviously it went super viral because I mean, you, you're just seeing a guy like dump a bunch of food on yeah. the table, right? Um, and then in 2021, um, I went out to LA, uh, for uh, about six months okay. and I was just shocked, like at what I saw. Um, the homeless problem in America is really bad and a lot of yeah. people don't realize, and I didn't realize myself cause I was never surrounded by it. Sure. So um, I just started thinking to myself, like, okay, I have this huge audience and I already do food content. Like, you know, instead of dumping all the food on the table, yeah. um, I could make, like, I could turn all this uh, food into meals for the homeless. Wow. So I actually came back to New Jersey uh, so that my whole family could help me do this. That's yeah. so nice. My whole family's involved. I make sure. I make sure. <laughs> Everyone has to do some work. I love that. Yeah. So um, came back here and towards the end of 2021, I started making huge meals for the homeless. Wow. That's amazing. Yeah. Now, how do you fund this? Yeah. Like, how does this work? Absolutely. So, I mean, you know, the cost of food right now is crazy expensive, yeah. right? Um, so I use my own, my own uh, income from the channels. Wow. Yeah. So, um, it all gets reinvested right back into the videos. And um, I've done a little bit of crowdfunding too. Okay. Um, I've partnered up with some brands. I'm going to be partnering up with a lot more in the new year to okay. fund everything. And uh, that's how I do it. All oh. comes from me. Wow. So what's in it for you, right? It, in case anybody doesn't know, you are 21 years old, which is <laughs> incredible to me. You have this massive following, you could really kind of probably at this point do whatever you want. What makes you want to do what you're doing now? Um, honestly, I think it just comes down to like what I'm passionate about. You know what I mean? Um, so I was raised, uh, like my, I mean, my family raised me to basically be like, if you could help someone out, then do it. Yeah. Um, and obviously, you know, at this point, like I have this massive following and like I could do good. And I really saw like, you know, once I started doing it, I just fell in love with it. Like watching people smile yeah. you know, and handing them meals or going to a shelter and feeding two, 300 people in one sitting. And, you know, people get to eat that, you know, they haven't eaten in two, three days and right. I fed them. Um, so I guess it really just comes down to like, I'm passionate about this and I really enjoy doing it. And it's just something that I love doing. And it shows yeah. for sure. Has the audience appreciated this pivot? Are you with the same people you started with? Or do you have a new audience now? Um, so I have literally the best fan base that I can ask oh. for online. They're all super supportive of it. And I still get comments like, wow, the switch up is crazy. Like you went from, you know, the wasting all this food yeah. to like donating all of it now. So I have like the most supportive audience I could literally ask for. Wow. They, they were on board immediately. Like of since course. I the first video of me make, I think my first video was me just making like regular sandwiches. Everyone was on board. So it was amazing. And you know, like they knew it was genuine. Yeah. Um, cause I like explained, you know, the whole situation of like, you know, why I wanted to switch and right. blah, blah. And it was just, it was very smooth and I'm super thankful for that. Wow. Thank you so, so much for being with us. Absolutely. Before I let you go, I have one last question. Do you think that me 
and our producer, Christina, would be welcome to come back with you again. Oh, absolutely. Whenever you want. You guys were great to have. It was oh. awesome energy. Oh, good. That's what, that's what we like to hear. <laughs> absolutely. Thank you so, so much for being of here. Of course. Thank you for having me. Oh. I had a blast. Amazing. <laughs>